Hello good folks, today we are going to see if we can make an entire indie game all by ourselves without spending a single penny. Technically it's not possible because in the end we have to pay the $100 Steam direct fee. But other than that I do believe that it is indeed possible. Let's begin. First and foremost you are going to need an engine. Most engines have a free version available and some engines are entirely free and open source. Once you have chosen an engine, you have to choose a style, 2D or 3D. If you go 2D, then you're going to need two softwares, one for image editing and one for sound editing. If you decide to go 3D, you will also need a 3D modeling software. For image editing, you can use GIMP and or Krita. For sound editing, you can use Audacity and LMMS. And if you're going with 3D, you can use Blender. All these software named here are 100% free and open source. So basically the game engine itself is the only software you may or may not have to pay for. Now on to the learning process. Some people like to take online courses in order to learn something. That in my opinion is the stupidest thing you can do. I learned everything from YouTube tutorials and forum posts. Everything. All software that I have used so far, every single aspect of them, I have learned from these two methods. Best thing to do is to go to YouTube and type in the following sentence. And usually you will find a series of YouTube videos that teaches the software step by step. And then of course you can learn specific things that are not covered in the series in separate videos or forum posts. In all my years of living, I have never actually learned anything from school or courses or learning books or anything. No, YouTube and forums. Also, very important, do not learn first and implement later. A lot of people start learning something using small and non-commercial projects for like two years and then they start working on something bigger. This is wrong. You need to start with a commercial project and learn on the go. There are two reasons for this. First one is that when you work on something commercial, you apply more value to it and it becomes more than just a student project. And because of that value, chances of you abandoning the project decreases. The second reason is that a commercial project forces you to learn marketing simultaneously with the development of the project. By doing these three things together, you reach your goal faster. Speaking of marketing, that is another thing that you do not have to pay for. Just watch my channel and you will learn everything necessary. And if my channel is not enough, check out Chris Zukowski's videos on Steam marketing. I will leave a few of them in the description below. Now let's talk about what you do have to pay for. And these are things that might creep up on you. First, in order to release a game on any platform, you have to register a company. This will have registration fee and later on accounting fee unless you can find a free accounting app and do it yourself. Then there is the matter of having your own website and a domain email address. Many companies require you to have an email address that ends with a unique domain in order to communicate with them. So website fees are something to look out for. In conclusion, you can almost make an entire indie game with no money at all. Almost.